We have condos right now in Miami who, if you say a disparaging word about one of the association members, it's in their rules. They will fine you. Spencer's not shaking his head in disbelief, but he knows it's true. I've seen that as well. They will fine you $100 as a unit owner if you say something mean about one of the associate, one of the condo board members on Facebook. That's actually in the rules. Folks, this is, this, is, this is the intention of all of this. You have criminal prosecution state attorney's office over here for, for, for a clear and, you know, beyond a reasonable doubt that this is something's wrong here, probable cause at the very least. You have Spencer over here who's trying to be a sweet, nice gentleman and what I'm trying to do is just make sure that they meet and there's no large gap in between. So if, if something needs to be referred or something like rises to the level and goes past his threshold, past his purview or, or vice versa, they refer to him. Conversely, prosecutors right now don't have a Spencer to give stuff to, to say this doesn't rise to the level of a felony, but it's certainly unethical. It's certainly actionable by your agency. And there has never been that connection for forever, really. And that's what we're trying to foster. Okay. He's like Elliot Ness Jr. Light diet, diet, diet Ness. 